The three plus million dollar idea is slated to take shape over the next 18 months or so. News 18's Bernie Tyner reports it's something business owners are eager to see. While drivers splash through the rain puddles on a dreary March day, the old Payless on old US 231 also has a gloomy, dark feel to it. We're just hoping to see that this part of town is lifted up. Um, this, this here can look a lot better than it does. First Assembly Community Ministries plans to create a community center just a block away from its church on Beck Lane. The plans call for a new daycare, space for teenagers, a banquet hall, and a gym. Senior pastor Robbie Bradford says retail stores will stay while the space at the grocery store will be used for the center. What we have here is a, a space that will, for one, give revenue to the government, the property tax that's there, but also um, it will become an asset in our community in terms of um, things that are, are nonprofit in nature um, and that, that offer, offer all kinds of resources freely to people. Next door to the vacant grocery store, co-owner of Deja Vu, Rick Carter, says they moved in once they found out the church was planning to revamp the place. He welcomes the idea of more traffic. Anytime that you can bring something from a dead zone was what a lot of this was. I mean, there was constantly beer bottles and trash and stuff here constantly. And, uh, you know, people are more willing to shop at a place if all the stores are occupied. A group of investors from the church bought the property, and now the church is working to raise funds. We're uh, taking commitments from our congregation. We're hoping to raise about $2.2 .2 million that will start much of these uh, changes. Bradford says building a gym will cost an additional $1 million. Renovations are set to start this spring with the hopes of the center opening in the fall of 2016. Reporting on the South Side, Brittany Tyner, News 18.